because I refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up, Barry. Uh, it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt rings. Right, the bouncer's guilt rings. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day. Andrew McCart, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Well, I've got to say, I didn't expect this on a Friday afternoon. Joe Laws, Harley Ben. I'll start with you, Joe. What happened? How did this come about? Well, I'm the fucking daddy for starters, right? And I'm winning this fight. And how it started, I didn't know how it started. Uh, I, I, I got tagged in the interview of IFL. Harley saying uh, he liked the fighters and all that. Uh, and I backed out from nobody. Me and Harley on the same position. Uh, we've both we've both been beat by a prospect. We've both been beat by a journeyman, right? We're two game fighters who can sell the fight. We can talk the talk and we can walk the walk. So let's get it on. You response to that, Harley? Yeah, well, if I'm honest with you, like like like, like Joseph, we're in similar stages. We both had a loss to someone we should maybe not have um, lost to. We've we've both lost to to good prospects. Um, I believe I have a, a a much better chin. I believe I have the beating of Joe Laws, and I think that the winner of this it propels it propels our career. If I'm honest with you, I think he's quite chinny. So um, I see I see me winning by stoppage. If I'm honest, Joe chinny for yeah listen i am going to knock you listen I, i'm not winning by a point Andy. i'm gonna i'm gonna knock him spark out hasn't fought anybody i he, he could say the same to me uh me pedigree is a lot better i think i beat harley ben anyway i got box him i got fight him i'm gonna steamroll him and i'm gonna smash him can i just say something can i just say what? something right listen so the 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 Fight before the the last fight I had, I got stopped in the seventh round by a good Fazan Amwar. The fight before that, I fought Alexander Zeledon, um, mm. and I think I I barely came out of first gear. I threw a jab, um, and I beat him with ease. I had some fun in there, and 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 Joe, I saw nearly got knocked out by him in the first round. Had a life and death. Yeah, you need to have got no chin. Hey, I don't care uh, if it's a genuine or prospect. If if any man hit you clean on. On the head, on on the chin, on the cranium. When you're cold, mm. you're all going to get you're all going to get wobbled. How many how get... many how many times have you touched the canvas in your pro career? <laughs> Fuck me, me pro career just against Valen Jordan, just against him about fucking two or three times. All right, how many times have I touched the canvas in my pro career? How many fights you had? Eleven. Eleven. I've had, I've had fifteen. Yeah, exactly. I've never touched the canvas and you're not going to be the man to make me touch the canvas. And what is going to happen here, I'm going to win the fight and it's going to propel my career. We both need a good win and I'll get the good win that I need. Harley, not obviously, you're, you're coming off that. I was in Dubai for your fight against uh, Faisal. Mm -hmm. um, like I say, you, you, the build-up to that fight, there was a lot of animosity to it. Do you need that animosity? Do you need that sort of hatred by people on the board? I don't really personally dislike Harley. He's a good kid, mm. but at the end of the day, it's a fight in sport. So we're, we're both big personalities. We talk the talk. Uh, so I'm not going to change my personality for anybody. Uh, up until the fight, I'm going to try and smash his head in. Like, there's respect there, but come fight day, I'm taking him out. Then after I shake his hand, you know, I'll buy him a Clara. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, like I said, there's, there's no... There is no bad blood, but he's in jo Joe Laws is is a perfect stepping stone for me, I believe. Like and it's stone, you a, per stupid a perfect you stepping stone, stone, stone for me. Man. He is. You are my stepping stone. He's he's, he's stepping a perfect stone. stepping what stone for me. He's gonna he's gonna propel my career when I beat him. Um, and that's what I need. That's what I need. I, listen, like you said, Andy, you was in Dubai. I had um. Mm. I had a fight with Fazan Amwar. I, I I got stopped. So now I want to go straight back at it and and. Yeah, Joe Laws is a good name to have on my record to get me to where I want to be. Fazil Amor, shite. You're shite, right? I'm gonna, I, I would beat you with Fazal Amor. That's what I would do and I'm going to Fazal do Fazal Amor beats you easy. 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 I beat you easy, I believe. I believe I beat you easy. What did... Ryland, Ryland Cholton had you doing funny dances in the ring. You fucking did, I, because you can fucking dance. <laughs> <laughs> what can you do? You can hit that hard and I'm turning the bitch, yeah, I did. 
What do you do? I'm fucking a hard food person. No, it's fair enough. Listen. Listen. It's fair enough. I don't think I think I think I think you're a good boxer. I just think Raylan I'm Colin stops you. Who? In your opinion? Raylan Charlton stops you in your opinion. No, no, oh, no. Yes. How much how much does he weigh? Was he called the pint size? No one with the name pint size in their name stops me. Let me tell you that. You look like you've came from a kinder bueno, man. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you look like no them little kinder surprises where you get the little toy and you make them up. <laughs> this case is off his head. <laughs> you know, I was all my fucking... Um, yeah, so to basically, Andy, probably, really and truly, whoever whoever loses this fight probably has to retire from pro boxing, really and truly, um, or, or or take another route. And unfortunately, that's probably going to be Joe. But he's had a good run. He's at his fault on big shows, matchroom cards, things like that. So I've just, he, he would have had I've a good just career. got started. Man. I've just got started. I'm 28, 20 years young, and I'm going nowhere. I'm 26. What's going to happen when I smash you? Where, where are you going to go? Uh, there's a few avenues, but I don't think you are going to smash me if I'm honest with you. So, 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 if I, if I, if I'm being completely honest, I see. Listen, I can be. You are a good scrapper. You can scrap. Let me tell you, I, you can scrap. But if I want to keep you on the end of my job for how many rounds of fight? Try that. Try that. See what happens. Easy, easy. Don't need to come out first gear. If I want to do, so, if I want to give some fans some exciting, some some exciting stuff, then I, then, then listen. I'll was, I'll was stand in the middle of the ring with you. But if I really want to, I can just dance around you. I could really and truly. I don't need to engage. I could beat you without breaking a sweat. I think. Yeah. Bomber Junior versus Ben Junior. Bomber Senior. This is Ben Senior. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, keep the unit of it, man. He's doing the steer with it. So, Phoenix, have a fuck off. <laughs> Let's get Listen, I'm hoping it's here. Well, it is, it is going to be my next fight. The next fight is going to be Ben versus Joe Laws. And like oh. I said, we're both confident we're going to win. Um, mm -hmm. But I'm going to win. So, listen, nah. listen, guys. Listen, listen, listen. Obviously... The, the fight needs to be promoted. There needs to be on a show. Have, what offers? Have, has there been any offers? Have you talked to anyone about getting this fight on a big platform? Yeah, there's been, there's been, there's been good offers um, and whatnot. We don't know that. I mean, if I'm honest with you, I think it's uh, for a promoter. I think it's a really good fight. If I'm honest with you, for for, for any promoter, it's it's north versus south. Um, it's with two big personalities. Like he said when he when when he first came on, he's the daddy in this. No. We we but we both think we are. It's it. I think it, it's it's a recipe for a great build up, a great fight, um, and there is a lot on the line as well, really and truly. Like I said, when I said um, the loser of this fight may may have to. It, it's a long way back. It's a long way back to, for the loser of this fight in the professional ranks. So it, there is a lot on the line as well, and I think it will be a good domestic fight. Yes, it would be a very, very good domestic fight. But we should do. We should fucking get a belt and say who's the daddy belt, because I'm gonna be the fucking daddy. <laughs> now, like a fight against you, a fight against you, right? Lights that spark. I'm not disrespecting no journeyman, right? But a fight in the journeyman hasn't got that spark. Two mm. loads in the Holy Ben. A fight did on a big platform. Now that gets us excited. Now, I'm going to do anything in my power to show up on that day and smash your teeth in, and you're going to do the same. So Exactly that. I'm glad you said that I'm going to do the same, because that's exactly what it is. It's going to be fireworks. And like I said, I just want to put it out there. If I want to, I can beat Joe Laws on my job, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to stop him. Try it. Try it. I'm going to stop him. I'll play with him for a bit, and then I'm going to stop him. You stupid good. Because... That's what I'm going to I'm I'm going no, to play with him. And then I'm gonna stop you. Play Monopoly and you couldn't stop me. I'm gonna... <laughs> so you, you couldn't do jack shit. I'm gonna play with him and then I'm gonna stop him when I want. Well, they see. What I've, I've, seen, I've seen both of you guys fights, right? And I've, Who do you I've never seen any of you take a backward step in a fight. Who do you mm -hmm. So, so you want to on the ring? And I think pride plays a part with the both of you. You're both proud men. So when it yeah. does come to it, I know you're talking about back foot and dancing, but when I see you used to fight and I see you used to come in, in the ring together when that fight happens, for me as a boxing fan and the guy that's watched both of you fight for a long time now, I can't see a backward step in this fight. I can see just 
Kai God, body, body, head, head, swing. Oh, don't, that gets me that's, excited. That's what I can see. That, that gets me excited. That gets me excited. But if he wants to stand in the middle of the ring and trade, either way, I'm going to win. I will come out on top. Head, body, body, head. Uh, listen, uh, my chin has been truly tested. Truly tested. I've been hit hard. I've been hit hard. I don't go nowhere. I don't go nowhere. I haven't touched the canvas, bro. I don't go nowhere. He I will go I'm somewhere. Not... If I hit him hard, he will go. Fazil, I'm almost like like candy floss. He looks the pole, but you pull a bit of water over me, just he just dissolves. He doesn't hit hard. Listen, in the, in that fight, that was that that listen, I, I didn't perform very well in that fight. That's me just being a bit brutally honest. Um I can't sit here and say that I did when I didn't. But from that fight you alone, you I I got hit so much. I didn't go nowhere. If you you if, if you was getting hit the way I was getting hit, you'd have been stopped in three rounds. <laughs> like well, it's it's listen, it's it's not a problem. Him. Like some people you can't train chin. Do you know what I mean? You can't train a chin. So I've yeah. never I've never been dropped or even wobbled on the chin. They've been the back of the headshots, headshots. All right, well you can't train head then. Whatever. Do you know what I mean? You can't train <laughs> You can't, you can't, you, you you can't train getting hit and taking it well. You don't take shots very well, and that's not a problem. You do a lot of things very well, but you don't take shots very well. Name some. Name some shots that you haven't took well. No, no, name some things that do well. Um, oh, good scrap. question, bro. Yeah, I, said, I, might, I, might, I might as well not be here. Yeah, no, 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 no. no. You, 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 you scrap well. You're, 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 a, you're a good fighter. Um, you stop entertain. Andy, now stop licking me off. Andy, from what you were saying there, Andy? No, I'm just saying, that's a good question. Obviously, you you both seen, like, traits that you can exploit in a fight between each other, right? But I'll ask both of you the same question. Harley, what does Joe do well? And then, Joe, what does Harley do well? Right. Harley, you first. Okay, so I, I believe Joe brings the heat to every fight he's in, really and truly. You don't really see him in a boring fight. Um... He he could it looks like he can hit slightly. Um nothing that would phase me, but he can he can hit slightly. Um he's got experience. I know he's been boxing from young. Um and I actually like like, like I said, I rate him as a fighter. I just think I'm better. Joe Holly uh he's got some nice curly hair. He wears some he wears a nice necklace. Uh, he's probably got a bowling and stuff like their balls and cards. But in the fighting scene, what I've seen from him, he's a bit higgly piggly. He's all over the gaff. He's like, uh, he's like, bam, you're nice. He's just all over. Do you want to say something? Bam, you're nice. Bam, you're nice. But he's he's the Bam be on ice says the one I've literally got I've literally watched you do some mad crazy dancing last night and you're calling me Bam you've never seen me like Bam be on ice on in a ring never go find try and find me wobbled in my whole 11 fights it's never been happened it's never happened never been wobbled you it got hit by the pint sized powerhouse and started doing a chicken dance all around the ring pint sized powerhouse would put you upside down though uh, but you, you, would you would say that you would say that you would say that I promise you, them shots he hit you with, they wouldn't have moved me. The first, In the first round, the one to the body. Oh, I see you. Uh, uh, like, all that shit, man. It it hurt. It yeah, I bet it did. <laughs> but, I bet it did, but don't Fucking start wincing. The minute you wince, if I make you wince, if I make you wince, you're, you're fucked, really and truly. Yeah, I'll be honest. You can make me wince, that's what I'm saying. I don't think you can. I don't think no one can. All right. I, I, okay, 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 okay. I'm um, Ryland Charlton was what? Did he start off at like a, a lightweight or a super lightweight or something? Andy, do you know? A lightweight, yeah. Down there. He started off as a lightweight. Okay, right. There we go. Yeah. And I'm not saying lightweights don't hit hard, but they do. They do. Some of the hardest hitting boxers are lightweights at the minute. Like there's some crazy hitting lightweights. But what I'm saying is, is I've 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 been middleweight, super middleweight, super welterweight, I haven't been any lower than that. He's it's, no, I'm sorry. You, uh, he wouldn't. He wouldn't have faced me. I think I would have beat Ryan Charlton. I tell you what's intriguing about this. Obviously, you're talking a good game on a camera. Will the same energy be there when it comes to the press conference, Harley? I know you bring the heat, and I know Joe brings the heat. So this energy is going to be there when it comes face to face as well. Oh, I, I hope so. so. Well, I hope so as well. I really hope so. Uh, we like. We are energy fighters. We are passionate fighters. Uh, so, like I say, it's a promoter's dream. Whatever platform we're on, this is the main event. Boxing's when born, new one. He's when born, when shift. Mm. All these prospects are good. 
But it's just like it's just sh- it's shit. There's like too many, it's too many apps to watch them on. Too many, too mm. many promotions. Too many this. Me and Harley Andy, you are... saw me in Dubai. I believe was you. You was at the press conference in Dubai that I had. Yes, I believe I made that press conference. I believe that I, I. I believe. I believe that the there, like Joe said, there's a lot of good prospects at the. Yeah, they make they may be boring. They don't really bring the heat, and and it's just for me and Joe both want to be top dog in this, and that's genuine. And like I said, there's a lot riding on this because whoever loses, really and truly, is a is a very very long way back. Um. Joe, how old are you now? Like 29, 28? 20 years. How old are you? Yeah, you old fuck. Do you know what I mean? I'm 26. I'm 26. So you look well, like 56. I don't. I actually look young. And if, if if we're going on, I, I'm I'm the better looking one in this fight as well. Oh yeah. Like, listen, there's no no, I just needed yeah, to make that clear. Listen, tell you tell any of your exes, right? Who's better looking than seeing me by a million billion percent? All right, okay. The will? You got hair like me pubes. <laughs> Look at that. For like say Joe Bob. <laughs> oh yeah, man, you guys are better looking than me, man. Leave that and something out of Geordie Shaw, man. Let's uh, listen, let's get let's get this let's get this on. <laughs> Listen, I'll end it with this, right? Because it's, it's been fun. And like I say, if the offers come and we get this fight on, as a boxing fan, I want to see it because I think boxing is an entertaining business. We've noticed that now. And it comes to the press conference in the way in. And Harley, we seen, I seen you out in Dubai. You did carry that press conference. You did make the press conference. Um, I will make the press conference in Dubai. I will bring an army from Bemel over Dubai and we'll take over Dubai. The, the, that, that will... That's what's going to happen. I will be wearing my vests and your shorts. I'll be bringing the bomb squad and we'll take over. Never mind Harley. Fuck Harley. No, 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 no. Listen, let's get this crazy. It's the Harley Ben show over here. Let's, let's, yeah, let's get that crazy. You're Bama just a part show. of it. I'm allowing you to be a part Bama of Bama it. Show. I'm I allowing you to be a part of it. I asked you what we want to fight it. Pick a weight. No bother. Be uh, great. Between what, 154, way. 160. We'll sort that out. No problem, flick a coin. No bother. Yeah, no problem. Either way, you get stopped. So, right, one final one from this. Listen, I'll start with you, Joe. Harley, you against Harley Ben. Whenever that happens, what's going to happen? Lay round stoppage. What round? Late round stoppage. Oh, Late for first the first round. For you said first round stoppage. Wow. Of course. Um, if I land, if I choose to, you got a very big head. I, that I do. That I it fucking do. <laughs> it goes no, no, your no, you're very, you're very, you're very. Yeah, I, I can't deny that. Physically, I have a big head. You have a lot to aim for. Harley, what's going to happen? Um, either wide points victory on my behalf, um, or a mid round stoppage. <laughs> Stupid cunt. <laughs> uh, I can't wait to punch him in his mouth. Fucking listen, it's, it's exciting. Listen, we all know the boxing game now is becoming an entertainment business as well as a, as a sport. And I think who do you again, reckon, Andy? Who do you reckon? From one spot. Who do you I'm reckon? Sitting, I'm, like, I'm sitting on a fence right now, so I'm game. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about who me. Who do you reckon? Eh? I mean, we're out of it. Who do you reckon will win? I'll tell you what, I'd beat your dad anyway. <laughs> <laughs> You'll fucking not beat me. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking good on her. Yeah, I'm looking good on her. I've picked before. You are, you are looking good. Yeah, 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 looking better than me anyway. <laughs> well, listen, like I said to you, let's, let's, I hope this fight gets made. Uh, I seen the interview with Joe Pugh with Harley when he mentioned Joe. And uh, you know what? When I heard that, I thought, and I, that, that, that made my ears perk up a little bit. And I was like, yeah, I'm, in, I'm intrigued with that one. So you talk a good game. You use a you're the flashy because you wear the Versace robe. I seen you out in Dubai, Harley, wearing the, the dish dash and all that as well. Which was... oh yeah, as well as best looking, I will get best dressed as well. Obviously, listen, he's not going to come near me in any department, unfortunately. Like I said, it's the Harley Ben show, and he can be part of it. One final he's message, Joe. Stone Raj, he's Stone Raj, Andy. Lives in his own little bubble. One final message, I, I you, do. Harley. It's a great place to live in this little bubble. Trust me. I would love to see you on fight night whenever that is. Let's go. September, October, let's go. Big show, you'll get knocked out, son. Yeah, we'll see. You'll be the first man to do it. 
Yeah, but I will be the first man to do it. See, we'll see if you're the first man to ever make me touch a canvas or not. That's good. I'd like to be the first man to put you on the canvas, but the other man, little pint size, took that away from me, didn't he? Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Listen, guys, thank you so much. Hopefully, this fight can get made, and when it does, I might even get you back on. This was entertaining, and I, and I loved every second of it. But listen, train, get the training camp started because I'm sure this will get picked up from some promoter, some platform somewhere. But Harley, enjoy the rest of your day. Joe, you look Thanks, like you're mate. But enjoy your day, well, mate. Well, and uh, listen, guys, speak to you soon. Well done. Joe, fuck you, Joe. Bye. Go fuck yourself, Harley. Go and fuck yourself. <laughs>